Connectors on a page can either intersect as straight crossing lines or as line jumps. And if you're creating a flow diagram in PowerPoint, you might want to change your connectors into line jumps that will make less confusing for your viewers to look at your chart. And since PowerPoint's lining tools aren't that sophisticated yet, here's a guide on how you can draw line jumps for your connectors. Open up the document you want to work on, and here we have an example flow diagram that have connector lines that cross each other. To start, head on the Insert tab, then select Shape, and then choose to add a line. Draw two vertical lines leaving a gap between them. Then go to the Insert tab again, select Shapes, and choose arc shape to draw a semicircle joining both of these. In doing a semicircle, slide in the inside control node toward the outside, creating a line arc. Then drag the bottom part of the shape and make sure that it looks like a half circle. Then you can also rotate it. Select all three shapes and group them together by right-clicking and select Group. Copy and paste this shape to wherever in the document you want this to be inserted. And that's how you create jump lines in a PowerPoint flow diagram. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.